Oh, yeah, I had a baby. So I'm working my way back off the floor. So I'm mean, onto the floor. Obviously, I had a baby a few uh, weeks ago. And so it's just a process for me getting back to 100%. So it's a lot going on and separation anxiety every time I have to leave them. But, um, you know, it's great to have so many women that you can talk to. There's a lot of women on my team who are, who are moms, Glory and Taylor, to, to talk to and kind of, um, you know, see how they, they're balancing everything. And, and it's a lot of women to reference in the, around the league who have children. And, um, yeah, it definitely brings a different perspective. I don't know if it's like a nurturing sense. I think we talked a little bit about, you know, a, a nurturing aspect, you know, to the team that I may bring now, maybe a sense of, of peace and understanding that, you know, plans change and kind of having a maturity, a new level of maturity to, my, to myself. And um, I feel accomplished too. Shit, pushing a baby out, you know, I feel accomplished. I feel like, you know, everything's into perspective for me now and things that were important to me really aren't. So I just try not to take any moment for granted. I, I definitely think, you know, your role for every every team, you know, may change as the years go by, you know what I'm saying? But for me, I'm on the sideline now. So for right now, just trying to be um, a coach on the sideline and just trying to back up Brian and trying to help the younger players and to just try to bring, you know, that, that role of leadership from the side now. So. Um, I'm on the floor a little bit with the girls, you know, and obviously, like I said, just trying to help everybody and, and just be available as a vet just to, you know, tr try to help it, help the process along the way.